everybody. My name is Anthony Tony Taylor. And you are now in my house. This is me casa, is your casa. So what I would love to do today, actually this evening, is show you my home. A little about me, I'm a freelance interior designer, singer-songwriter, under soon to be a great contract with Sony Records, poet, artist, and humanitarian and spiritually connected in that way. So a little brief tour of my home, what you see here is a beautiful table from Brazil. And my good friend Fernando Mendoza is taking the pictures. The chairs are from Indonesia. When I moved in here, as you can see on the ceiling, it's textured. But prior to me moving in here, it was horribly textured with a popcorn asbestos ceiling that I had to take off, acoustic ceiling. Then I put up all the crown molding as Fernando was showing you. And then the wall to Fernando's front is a faux finish that I used, a certain technique that I saw when I used to live in Europe. And the floor Again, prior to me moving in, it was all carpeted. So I stripped it all down and refinished the floor. And this beautiful image you see on my screen right now is a beautiful image from Mr. Colbert. Ashes and Snow. Gregory Colbert where he photographs humans with animals in their wild habitat. Beautiful imagery. So in fact, a friend of mine told me that, you know, Tony, your, your place is really beautiful and it has everything that you could want as an artist. But he said, except for one thing, he said, it's incomplete. I said, what's that? He said. You don't have a woman here. Well, let me tell you, my Garden of Eden woman will be here one day. And you know who I'm talking about. You know who you are. So, when that time comes, please give my beautiful greetings to Mitali and to Marianti. They'll understand when they grow up. Continuing in the kitchen, follow me, Fernando. In the kitchen, I use a special technique on the cupboards. It's a trompe l'oeil, as they say in French, trick of the eye. Now, it looks like natural wood grain, but in reality, it's not. It's a trick of the eye because it's actually painted, see? But it looks like it's grain. The picture here is from Austria. It's called By den Großeltern, or With the Grandparents. The floor, I did a California slate. Everything in this place before I moved in was black and white. Checkered floors. As you can see on the kitchen sink, that's the last remaining part that I have to do. The last remaining part is this godforsaken countertop. And I want to make it so where it's, it's beautiful. And my parents always taught us children when we were growing up that when you have a place, it should be the type of place that basically, you know, you, it's yours and, and it's your emotional thumbprint. But it also should be the type of place that when your friends come, makes them feel emotionally safe, so safe that they want to sleep there. And that's the vibe that I get. Behind Fernando is a work of mine, a still life, I painted that. The lights here are from Morocco. And 
And as you can see, the other pictures Fernando is showing you is an idea of the type of work that I do and the sensibility of what is important for me, as well as all the furniture and the kitchen. As you know, it's, it's, pretty, <laughs> it's pretty packed here. But hey, I like, I like the beauty around me. Aestheticism, like Tolstoy said, beauty will save the world. music that you're listening to while uh, Fernando gives you a shot of all the artwork that I have and the photographs. Some of mine are up here on display. Others are other work from other artists, photographers. In fact, the one that you're showing right now is a friend of mine. He took this in Papua New Guinea. This is, a, this is on the cover of National Geographic many years ago. Uh, the music that you're listening to while uh, Fernando again is showing you viewer, the pictures and images here, is from a beautiful movie called All the Mornings of the World with Gerard Depardieu. My French is not very well, in fact it's pretty non-existent, but it's a beautiful movie and we're listening to the soundtrack by Jordi Saval. He won an Oscar for the best soundtrack of that year. Tule Martin du Monde. I believe that's how it's pronounced. And again, the floor gives you an idea of the hard work. I stripped it down and put six coats of finish on the floor. Again, this video is entitled, Mi Casa is Your Casa, from Anthony Tony Taylor. Any prospective customers or clients, you'll get an idea. This picture here is where my mother's side of the family is from, which is Jamaica. And as Fernando shows you more of the images, I'm trying to paint an emotional thumbprint on the canvas of your mind and hearts. That's exactly what I'm trying to do. As we enter the bathroom, I gold leafed the bathroom trim and the walls are again a faux finish. I wanted an antique look like old Europe. So the house is a mixture of old Europe, Latin America, and the Caribbean. The picture, of course, is Middle Europe, and this right here is actually from, hello, it's actually from Iran. It's a very, very sacred artifact. Opens to all culture, opens all portals, right? Iran. The door, I took my towels off here, is actual gumwood door, a gumwood door circa 1923. The home was built in 1923, 1924, so I want to have original doors. And notice the glass doorknobs. Increíble, huh? Hermoso. It's a little reminiscent of South America, too, because I spend uh, two months every year in, in Buenos Aires, Argentina, and 10 months in Long Beach. I'll be going back and forth. So we're going to enter into my bedroom. And this is my sacred spot. The bed here was made by a good friend of mine, a general contractor. Recycled wood and then I stained it all. And it's just, it's a warm bed. <laughs> what else can I say? And here are pictures of my, my beautiful mother and my father. My father had just died in August, and Fernando will give you a close shot of the picture with the chest that it's on. 
again, varying ideas of decorative style. But my parents are and were my father. A strong black panther, but a gentle rose from my soul. Took this picture to the right of Fernando in marble, Colorado, an abandoned mine shaft for marble. It's a beautiful picture, huh? Marble, Colorado. So if you ever in Mar are in, if you are ever in Marble, Colorado, you'll know that. Hey, that's a picture that Anthony Tony Taylor took. Another example of the door, gumwood door. So, so as Fernando is going around, I will leave you in peace with my friend Fernando. And just remember that we must be the change. As Gandhi said, Mahatma Gandhi, we must be the change that we want to see in the world individually, right? Exactly. So enjoy. And I hope that this was a little brief tour, that this little brief tour was somewhat pleasing to you. Again, this is Anthony Tony Taylor. Mi casa is your casa. So, it's waiting for my Garden of Eden woman somewhere in the Mediterranean, maybe. Greece, perhaps. Exotic. Thank you for your time. Fernando will show you more.